Good evening, Fiend fans. And welcome to my crawly crypt. This little drama is about one of life's unexpected pleasures. Dying, that is. Most of us only get to do it once. And it's all over before you can really enjoy it. But one man did get to die again. And he liked it so much, he started doing it for a living. <sighs> this is the story of Ulrich the Undying, a sideshow performer who found death not only fun, but profitable. In fact, he is dying to put on a show for you right now. <laughs> Come gather round, gather round. Come from far, come from near, gather round, folks. Right over here. Come see the show. 100% natural, nothing artificial. Guaranteed no pesticides, ah, but perhaps a homicide. Tonight, a special show. Two shows in one. The tragedy of death and the miracle of resurrection. <laughs> Tonight, this man, our very own Ulrich the Undying, will be sealed into a coffin and buried in a grave six feet under to await his inevitable expiration by the grasp of suffocation. <laughs> I call to your attention the clock, which hangs above his grave. Ulrich will be buried alive at precisely the stroke of midnight, but we're not gonna let him out until noon tomorrow, at which time his precious, precious oxygen will have been exhausted. <laughs> Folks, this is an escape that Houdini himself couldn't have gotten out of. I give to you Ulrich the Undying! <laughs> When they dig me up, I'll be dead. Just like all those bastards want me to be. But I won't stay that way. I remember the day it all began. Who are you? How would you like to be rich? Hey, get out. Richer than you ever thought possible. Richer than you ever dreamed of. Mm. This money, my life savings, will be yours. If you consent to a small experiment. <laughs> yes, my friend. Come. Where? Where? Where is it? Where is it? This, uh, you'll pardon the term, is a CAT scan. It shows the blood flow into the brain of a healthy house cat. This shows the brain of a cat near death. No, what's your point, Doc? My point is that this cat didn't die, not permanently. An hour later, he was healthy as a kid. And the same thing happened again and again until the ninth time when he finally stayed dead. Oh, different cat, huh? What's all this got to do with me? Well, I... I want to give you those oh. nine lives the next best... Don't touch! 
the next best thing to being immortal. It's, it's a simple matter, really. Uh, removing a gland from a common cat and uh -huh. surgically grafting it into your brain. Wait, 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 wait. Into my brain? <sighs> oh, so I can die nine times. Now you're making sense, Doc. Precisely. Now, oh, and this is where you're going to do it, huh? I'm going to get your gland. And these are the tools of the profession. Hey, wait a minute. If this don't work... If it doesn't work, you have no complaints. <laughs> Holy... Christ, I've had hangovers before. But this is terrible. My head. Hey, wait a minute, Doc. You didn't say you were gonna shave my head. How do you feel? Shitty. Doc, did it work? Absolutely fabulous. Fantastic. You now have the nine lives of this poor cat. Wait a minute. How do I know I've got nine lives? They sought to kill you. There's no doubt about it. No! Welcome back to life, my friend. You bastard! You tried to kill me! I didn't try to kill you. I did kill you. Deadlier than Calcius nuts. And I guess you'll die eight more times. All right. If that's true, when do I get my money? As I promised, right now. But... Before you stagger into the nearest bar to slurp down your money, how would you like to make a hundred times more? A, a thousand? No, no. What else do you want to do to me? Nothing, dear boy. Just thought perhaps your special talent would make us both a lot of money. Enough to finance my years of my longevity research and enough, of course, to buy you an ocean of alcohol. What do I got to do? First, you need a shave. Trying not to cut your own throat. Those extra lies are too valuable to waste. Why not? It'll be worth millions. No, I'm not interested. I've seen escape backs. The only thing that disappears is the audience. Yeah, but Ulrich the Undying is different. You see, he doesn't escape. He actually dies right before your eyes. That's why we can only schedule a limited number of performances. He dies? Yes. Okay, strange love, I'll give it a shot. I hope it works. I can use the money. My freaks need a new shoe. Gather round, gather round as Ulrich the Undying defies the drowning chamber, a watery nightmare for which there is no escape. Three minutes is enough to kill any mere mortal, but Ulrich will remain underwater for a full hour, as verified by the imminent Dr. Manfred Mann. Dr. Emil Manfred. Whatever you say, Doc. Are you ready? Huh? Are you ready? Uh, oh, yeah, I'm ready. OK, boys, oh. fill her up. Ladies and gentlemen, as the water engulfs over, I beg you to control your emotions. Make no move to save him! Oh, oh, so oh, back oh, on it. You want after, you after? Born in the liberal Shiite parents. He was a child prodigy who spent his early years in the Then he took her away. He finished it. Dinner with me later. Dinner! Ah! That's it. 
He's deader than a possum on the interstate. He's deader than shit! <laughs> Don't worry, folks. We're gonna still keep him in there for a full hour! May I have the official clock? He's dead. He's officially dead. Thank you, Dr. Manfred. Drain the tank! This may seem like Ulrich's last performance, but don't go away yet, folks. For Ulrich is a man who lives only to die again. I give you resurrection! Resurrection! Is he gonna come back for dinner? Of course he's gonna come back! Resurrection, Doc! Resurrect! Resurrection! Folks, don't go away! in trouble in some states for this. Resurrection! Resurrection! Folks, folks, come away! Resurrection! I'd be happy to give you a rain check, Captain. Resurrection! Get the fuck up! Get folks, folks, this way. Italian food. I'm buying. Oh, Doc, get me a towel. Hey, I'm resurrected. Oh, resurrection! Resurrection! He's alive! Resurrection! Get around! Get around! Just think, Doc. Time grand just to let them watch me drown out in the 10 o'clock news. <laughs> Don't forget, we already that 60% goes to continue my longevity research. Hey, Doc, relax. We got a partnership. And I got a date. That's one thing I'll say for old Doc Manfred. He wasted no time getting me killed again. Got a rat! Gather round for a little frontier justice, as our own Ulrich the Undying is going to have a little necktie party as he gets his neck stretched before our very eyes. He's like a nice day to die. I became a sensation. Crowds would gather for miles around just to see me bite the big one. Hey, how's it going? Let's come. Let's come back. Hey, seen you last time. Yeah. Ladies, gentlemen, Texas, and other faint hearted may want to turn your eyes away from this horrible example of what happens when you do the dirty in the dirty town of Dastardly. I said I don't want to do it. Corley, pull, pull, pull left. You do it. I don't pull want to do it. Well, there's not much riding upstairs, but downstairs, what's counting? Corley, pull, pull left. <laughs> Money is there. <laughs> as long as I get my percentage. Hey, Doc, no problem. I mean, after all, you're the guy counting the money, right? Hey, well, I want my share. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Doc, thanks a million. Thanks a million. Jewelry! I want to see Mr. Friendly. <laughs> I figured it was time to boost my profits. So I waited just for the right moment. I think what a strange machine the human body is, Ulrich. Yeah, how about that? You can kill a man by destroying less than 1% of his body. He can be 99% healthy and dead. Amazing, isn't it? Every human body is like a walking chemistry set, and if anything happens to upset that delicate balance, death. Jesus. That's why you're so amazing, Ulrich. Because your body fixes itself, and it's going to make us both a lot of money. Well, Doc, you're half right about that. See, it's gonna make me a lot of money. See, I gotta breach our contract, Doc. You're about to die in a terrible car accident. What are you talking about? That's murder. Yeah, Doc, but who's gonna suspect me? I mean, after all, I'll die with you. But hey, I got six well, lives. Wait. How many lives oh, do you have? Wait! Can we wait, wait? Slow down! <laughs> wait! wait. <laughs> no hard feelings, Doc. 
Gather mm. round, gather round. Tonight, a special delight. This is no hoax, ladies and gentlemen. In a few minutes, our own Ulrich, the man who lives to die, will be quick fried with a burst of electrical energy. And one of you lucky folks is going to be the one to pull the switch. Holly, mm. you draw the lucky number. Um, lucky number is a oh, five, two. It's a, one it's a five. Five. One five. zero five nine. Zero! That's me! <laughs> Come up here and claim your prize! Congratulations! You get the prize, my boyfriend! Or, do you have any last words? Yes, I do. I'd like to dedicate this death to the memory of Dr. Emil Manfred, my dear friend, who would have wanted me to continue. Shut up and cook him! Are you ready? You bet your ass I'm ready. I'm ready to die. <laughs> then no come. Go for it, Grandma. <laughs> Shocking, isn't it? <laughs> Looks like that's the end of old Ulrich, eh? Take and take. Resurrection! Or are you gonna make a liar out of me? Resurrection! Okay, Ulrich. 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 Resurrection! Ulrich. Uh, just a gag. Oh, she's a kid. Come on, Ulrich. Resurrection! Come on, Ulrich. Come on. Resurrection! Come on. One thing I hadn't figured. Some resurrections take longer than others. Appreciate your business. All right, now, first we drain the mess. <laughs> Well, you could have fooled me. Now, please excuse me. I have a very tight schedule. Oh! Oh! Hey, oh! 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 The next time, I made special arrangements. Corley was gonna get my body no matter what. Gather round, gather round! Shoot an arrow, lay the bear in the ground! Now, for your pleasure, for a limited time only, is a chance to kill a real-life oh, human being! <laughs> I'm dying to die! Come on, hit me, hit me! Uh, in the heart, in the heart! Give him a heart on, as it will. <laughs> yeah! Yes, come on up here. Oh, oh, a man of the sea. Come on. come on up here, son. Come on up here, Admiral. Come on, Navy, let's go. Show that bimbo what you got. That'll be $1,000, please. Come on, come on, what's $1,000 when you have to kill a real human being? Yeah. Come on, what are you, afraid? Yes. No, well, then, anchors away, Popeye. Okay, move away, move away. Come on, let's go. Who'll be next? Come on, what an opportunity. Oh, here's a macho man. <laughs> the puppet iron, I see, huh? Yeah, yes, we do take credit cards. Oh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, step right up there, son. Time on, is money. Bonzo! Don't play to the crowd, play to the bear. That's the one you're trying to kill. Come on, he's dying to die. <laughs> Come on, asshole! Where'd you get that hat? Shut up! Oh, get the bear. Oh, one shot. One shot you have here. Come on, boy. You gonna do it. I know you can. Go bears over there. Go bears over there. Get out of here. Oh, he's That's gonna it. kill it. That's it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Aim! Fire! so near and yet so far. As the French say, see tough shit. <laughs> <laughs> Who's next? Come on, fun for the whole family! Junior's gonna give it a try. 
a father and son team. Can do it. Come on. I know you can do it. What are we going? Thousand? One thousand dollars. Well worth it for my son. Come on, Ju Junior. Don't be a sissy now. I don't want to. Junior. Listen to your father, son. Listen to your father. All right, come on. I'm going to get your junior membership in the NRA. Your some kids kill to. rabbits, you can kill people. Come on now. Put your hand up. I don't want to kill anybody. Come on, I've been killing people for years. And now it's your turn. Come on, you can line it up. No. Steady. Now. <laughs> That on purpose, Junior. You did it, Junior. You did it on purpose, Junior. You little fat fuck. All right, who'll be next? Come on. A personal check? Uh, yes, we take personal checks. Uh, I'll need two pieces of identification, please. Uh, look at this. Look at this. State Fair Archery Champion 1987. Oh. Well, if anyone can hit him, I guess he can, huh? <laughs> Go get him, sir, and good luck to you. I'm sorry, but you can't move him. Uh, I, um, I have a special arrangement with the disease. Doesn't make any difference. Uh, tell me to keep this. There was any injections. Holy shit. This is more money than I make in a year. You're welcome. Can I help you move the body? Yeah. I made the front page. Shitty picture. How you feeling, honey? Baby, this dying shit's taking years off my life. Oh. I get it. Who is it? Gather round, gather round. Here we go. 80% of the box office right. take, payola from HBO, and some side bet money, too. Gimme, oh, gimme, gimme. You know, Ori Booby, on a more personal note, I want you to sincerely know how how, how, how I want you to know. Yeah. Remember me, Connie, as Sue Connie. 60,000. Orly, baby. Yeah? What do you say we take a vacation? Mm. Go over to Vegas, catch Wayne Newton's act, hop over to the Bahamas, and then uh, we'll skip over to Paris. Hey, did I tell you? Polanski wants to film my life story. All of them. Yeah? That sounds wonderful. But I had an even better idea. I'll go on vacation, and you... What? I want everything. All of the profits, 100%. 100%, but that'll leave me with practically nothing. Look, asshole, don't you remember what a shithouse this place was before I showed up? Besides, I can't help but think what the audience will do when their star attraction pulls a no-show. That's blackmail. That's right. All right. All right what? All right, 100%. And I don't know how you can live with yourself. I don't. That sucker. If I wanted, I could have got a share from his corn dog concessions. 
By the old clock on my wrist, it seems that each hour is approached. Come on, boys. The time has come. Warm down. There we go. Hey, listen, Lord, when you get to hell, don't forget the right. <laughs> hey, there's mud in your eye. <laughs> Although I do feel a little bad about the doc. Ah, but what the hey? I'm already set for life. And all because of that poor little kitty. Poor dead little kitty. Too bad he had to die. Wait a minute. That cat, it died. It already died once. It only had eight lives left. Oh my God. I don't have nine lives. Hey! Hey, somebody! Well, you ought to be about out of here by now. You kidding? Grow up. It's all a fake. Yeah? You think so? Of course. You don't think they really let someone die down there. Nobody wait! I don't have nine lives! You hear something, Al? Nah. Probably just a cat. Yeah, right. Just a cat. Put it in between Wheel of Misfortune and the newly dead game. <laughs> Unless they buried it in the wrong time slot. 